So I'm on the web and I find the water vapor video from the NASA Goddard Scientific Visualization Studio, and it looks cool. And then I find the evaporation video and I'm stunned by the continents floating on a sea of mist. It takes me a minute to see that that's the sun heating things up and starting the evaporation on the land. And it stops at night, and I realize I just have to remix these. I download the videos, thanks everybody, and grab one of the NASA blue marble frames and drop the evaporation movie onto it. I color it blue because evaporation cools things down. I use the July blue marble image because the illumination cycle looks like it's summer in the northern hemisphere. After I shake off my trance, the water vapor flow video goes on, and I'm sucked in again by how the evaporation becomes vapor and flows around the world. Precipitation completes the water cycle and shows where the heat ends up. I could study this for hours, seeing how the atmosphere moves and flows. As the NASA Goddard site says, water regulates the works. Water stores heat during the day and releases it at night. Tropical waters flow toward the poles, circulating heat around the planet. Check the NASA Goddard Visualization Explorer site.